How's it going everyone? Welcome back to another video on the channel. Today I am fresh from Istanbul as I went to Galatasaray versus Barcelona in the Europa League with Fogden. But today I'm off to Barrow back in London making my way up to Barrow in Furness to watch them face Carlisle in the Cumbrian Derby. I got there in the end. It should be a really good atmosphere and I can tick off the Barrow Stadium off the 92. If you do go on to enjoy this video then make sure you drop a like. I've got a very very special guest who's going to be featuring on the channel later and that is none other than Footy Adventures. You may know him if you're from Scotland or in general from England. He's been to Portugal and all that lately so it'll be really nice to ask him a few questions about his trip and all the experiences in Scotland. He's a really nice guy but without further ado let's travel up to Barrow in Furness and see what this Cumbrian Derby is all about. Four hours sleep, fresh from Istanbul, and I'm ready for a five hour train to Barrow. So I'm in Wigan now, I've got to wait here for about an hour before my next train to Barrow, and I don't understand what there is in Wigan to do for an hour. Here we are, subway. That'll do me, lunch is sorted. Right, the mighty subway is consumed. Now let's get ourselves to Barrow. Can't wait to get there, absolutely buzzing. Right then, here we are in Cumbria, Barrow. At least the sun's out. I know I've got a coat on, I've got a big bag with me, but hey, we're here in Barrow, sick of the stadium and see what it's all about. Right, I don't know where I'm going, so I'm just going to follow the crowd, but it's 1pm here, sun's out, and I'm quite hot. Yeah, I've got a big coat on, which isn't ideal, but hey, it's all about the football today. I can't wait. See what the fans are all about in Barrow, of course. Carlo on very good form. They've won four on the bounce, and then they did get a loss last week against Newport, I want to say. Barrow, they just keep drawing nil-nil. And I'm going to say straight up, I don't know any players from either side, if I'm honest, but I'm going to say a nil-nil today. So I take it, this is where the Carlisle fans drink, or the Barrow fans drink. I don't know. Either way, there's so much police down here. That's the thing with me. I don't know how... Like feisty this fixture will be. I've never really experienced it before. I go to Rome Derby, I go to all of this. But the Cumbrian Derby, not many people know what it's all about. I don't think I could have picked a better day to have come to Barrow. Not a cloud in sight, my friends. Okay, so I've ditched the coat, but I can't tell if it's because it's sunny. But I think that this is actually not a bad area at all. Because the sun is so bright, it's clear skies, I've got positive vibes. I don't know if it's because of the sun, but I think that this place is nice. But it looks quite good from first impressions. So I'm going on my adventures. Uh, what have I found here then? I found a stadium. When I find stadiums, I get quite excited because I love ticking them off. Hold on, I'm going to have a little quick look here. I'm meant to be meeting Footy Adventures. The home of Barrow Raiders, RLFC. Is it rugby? Um, I don't know if this is trespassing, but it's a rugby stadium. Barrow have got a rugby club. If I didn't come Barrow, I wouldn't even know. But I walk past the stadium, I love stadiums, and I'm here. Not bad. See, see what do you explore in this world? This is sick. Although, rugby, I'm not a fan of. Let's put it that way. It must all be kicking off. That's, that's about three or four vans going down this road on a 30 miles per hour going at about 60. Yeah, it's kicking off somewhere, folks. It's kicking off somewhere. You've got an answer here. You've got the stadium there. Um, not much not much to show for the Barrow Stadium, I must admit. The Soccer Bar Barrow Football Supporter Club. I'll tell you what, I never have points on the channel. I absolutely never drink on the channel. But I'll tell you what, today it's a special day. We're in Barrow, sunshine, and let's get a pint. Just gone for the standard pint of Carlin. £3.20. I think that's, that's fine. You go to London, it's about a fiver for this. I never drink on the channel, but today's a good day. The sun's shining in England for once, and you've got to have a beer. Cheers. Okay, so I'm joined with Jay and Ryan. How you doing, folks? You excited for today's game? Yeah. yeah how big is this Cumbrian derby, man? Just had. Big. Is it big? Yeah. Oh man, I didn't even know this. So, what's your predictions? I'm saying two one. Two one. Oh, comeback. I like it. Two one. Yeah. So yeah, I don't know what to expect when it comes to this derby. So if someone like me goes everywhere around the country, I'm excited to see what it's all about. Cheers, lads. Enjoy the game. Enjoy the game. So that is what is special about the game. I did not even realise how big this Cumbrian derby is. The fact they haven't even faced each other in a competitive game for like 50 years I heard from a bloke. I'm not sure how accurate the figures are, but I'll tell you what. It's uh, it's quite a big derby from what I've heard. So I'm quite interested to get in there and see how feisty this atmosphere is. Here's another thing I've just realised. There's a football club 
next to a football club, Barrow here, you got Furness Rovers Football Club here and a pitch just there. I arrived in Barrow at one o'clock and I'm actually finding a lot more things to do and see as the time goes along. I'm actually loving this. This is the magic of traveling. Get out there and travel, folks. Right, I'm joined with Lewis, Barrow fan, of course. Now, how big is this derby? Because I don't really know much about this. It's a massive derby. Yeah. It's massive for us, for the fans, for the team. And when was the last time you actually like played Carlisle last? Well, 50 years ago, I think. 50 years. Yeah. So that's how huge this game is then. Yeah. What's your prediction? 1-1. One, 1-1. One. One, one. I'll tell you what, a club like Barrow, even being in this league, a stadium like this, the size of the club, I'm kind of surprised in the first place that it's in League 2 of the Football League, of course, by eight. Right, Jack, Barrow fan, of course. What's your prediction, mate? Come on, tell me. Um, we're going to win 2-1. Two, 2-1, one. Two, one. who's scoring? I don't know any players. Ah, oh, good man. Enjoy the game, mate, all right? I'm joined with Barrow on tour. What is your prediction, mate? Yeah, I'm going to call 2-0 for the Bluebirds. Big game, isn't it? Can you tell me a bit about this derby? Like, is it a big, big game, is it? Big yeah. First time we've actually been able to go and see it. Okay. And you're confident you're going to get a win today? Yeah. Good man. Enjoy the game, right? And subscribe to his channel, right? Charlie and Oliver, two Barrow fans. Give me your predictions, lads. I think it's going to be 3-1 for Barrow. It's John Rooney after Oh, I hope you're right, mate. I'm going to go 3-1 Barrow. 3-1? Oh, come on, lads. Enjoy it, yeah? Right then, lads. Barrow fans, what are your predictions? 1-0 uh, 1-0, yeah? 2-1 yeah. Two, one. Two, one. Two, one. Two, one. Come on, the boys. Not long until kick-off now, which should be really good. The atmosphere's already starting. But there's one person who I've not got on the video yet. One second. We've got the man himself. Uh, it's the adventures. Hello, well, good meet you. I know. How are we all doing? Good, mate. Good. Yourself? Right. I'm going I'm very well, mate. We're at the Cumbrian Derby. We are, We're we expecting are. big things, aren't we? We are, mate. It's absolutely mad in here. Like, I didn't expect it to be this. Neither did I. That stand over there, if you can just pan around a little bit. Come on. Oh, oh they, these boys love it too. They love it. Come on. We have 5,000 capacity here today, and I think it's pretty much full. It is. And please make sure you subscribe to his channel. He's travelled from Scotland. Yeah, from I know. Scotland. I know it's quite near actually compared to where I am, but it's closer than where you're from. Still an absolute treasure. That, that is Once true. Adventures. Check me out on YouTube. Yeah. Link in the description. Here we go then. Barrow versus Carlisle. Fans with full voices. And here we have Carlisle kicking us off with this Cumbrian derby. Oh, maybe not. this count still in there hold on go on go on there is no way i'm very confused about how they have not scored so many opportunities now to put the ball over the line it has not happened yet half time one nil to carlisle and there's booze at half time is the goal coming mate it's coming Oh, he's calling it. Might it. Be I hope I'm, so. I'm right. saying it's coming over. It's not coming, but dude, literally, we came here to get a better view of the game. But it's been all up there. Yeah, has not it? Carlisle and we can't even see the in. goal. I know. Carlisle is just sitting in. We're hoping that Barrow score and we get like a good view. We of hope so. We hope so. Fans behind the goal here, but let's hope for the best, mate. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on, I'm backing you. These away fans are loving it. They're one all up. 650 of them. Whee! That's cleared. To me, it's conversion. Oh my god. The state, oh my god, you're way in. That is carnage. The state of that away end. I tell you what though, the defending, the keeper, they've had a howler there. The striker, the striker put it in front, beat the keeper to it. 
and there you go, 2-0. That should really be game set, and there's like, some serious limbs in there. Also, it's a massive derby, so you got, when you're going 2-0 up, I mean, you know how big it's going to be for the Columbia and derby. It hasn't been going on for like 50 years or something competitively, so a massive goal, 2-0 Carlos. It's really hard for Barrow to get back into the game now, even though they had a really good spell at the start of the second half, so it's unfortunate, but hey, Carlos have done well there. 2-0 up, great scenes. It's unfortunate for Barrow's sake. Um, wow. There's been a goal and they're back in the game, Barrow. They're back in the game. I was speaking to Fritty Adventures and somehow they went from the corner to get a goal back. So I don't even know how the goal went in. But it's 2-1 and they're back in the game now. They've got a quick goal after Carlo got a second goal. So who knows? It could go either way now. It could be an equaliser 2-2. Well, they could just hold on. Who knows? But they're back in the game. Lads being kicked out. Look, there's a fan who's just run on the pitch. That's his dad or something, I think. I don't even know what's going on here. But this ain't this ain't going well in the away end because I feel like it's kicking off before that. When the fan goes and runs on, you got this guy over here. It's really kicking off between these now. I don't know what's going on. But my guess is that could be his son. Run, who ran on the pitch, that's only a guess anyway. The Cambrian Darby's getting a bit more feisty now, you can feel it, you can feel the tension, it's kicking off on the pitch now oh, between the players. Oh, this is what you want, this, this is the Derby. There is something seriously going on between the stewards here. The stewards and the fans. Will these fans get the equaliser they really desperately want? Oh god, it's going for a Ronaldo set up here. Oh, oh my god! I thought it was going to be a little Cristiano there, but I'll tell you what, nearly tripled in its way in. There's only about five minutes go, then injury time. It's going to be difficult for them to get equaliser, but they've got the heart and desire for this. They could do it. One of the last few minutes. Oh, dearie me. Oh, dearie me. Yep, yep. Yep, people going. Yep. I have watching that free kicker, don't blame him. There we go, full time. There we go. Carlisle have won the Cumbrian derby. The three points is theirs. They've done it. Congratulations, Carlisle. But I do feel for these Barrow fans. They're all top lads, the ones I've met today. I've been top quality. Honestly, a really, really friendly club. Amazing people. Everyone I've met have been so friendly and so welcoming, to be honest. You know, someone like me who's been coming all this way to come to a club like Barrow, really small club in the NFL, League 2, no one really comes here and kind of exposes a club like Barrow. So I thought I'd come here today for the Cumbria and Derby, and it did not disappoint. In the sun too, sunny Barrow, and I've got to come again at some point. I don't know when, because it's so far away, but nevertheless, I really, really Really enjoyed this experience at Barrow. So fair play to you all. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a like. Please share this video around to everyone you know. Follow my Instagram, my Twitter, my TikTok, absolutely everything. And I'll see you guys in another video very, very soon. Goodbye, guys.